Hi everybody, welcome back. I'm Disha and I'm here to help you transform your house into a home. And today I have all this bamboo stuff lying in front of me because today I'm going to show you how these bamboo baskets can be used in various ways and uh, how with a little creativity we can take these bamboo baskets to the next level. It's super easy, it won't take much of your time and uh, efforts. Also, I prefer to buy all this stuff from local artisans and craftsmen because that way I think we can help and support them. And uh, also bamboo is something which is environment friendly unlike plastic. So we have two good reasons, right? Think about it. Now let's begin. Yes basket as a lamp looks super gorgeous i had made my first two years back which i'm gonna show you a little later here i am making a single hanging lamp and for that i'm using this round basket i have already cut the base using craft knife this is the fixture that is easily available in local market or you can check out the link in the description box if you want to buy online first i'm gonna remove this clamp and then fix the holder in the basket and secure it with clamp now let's put the bulb and enjoy the ambience This is my first DIY lamp I was talking about. It's a canopy. It has multiple cables and holders. It's not easily available online. You can search in local market though. So first, according to the size of holder, I had cut the base of the baskets using craft knife like so. I have done this on three baskets and now I'm gonna fix the holders in the baskets. Now let's attach the cables to the canopy. The length of the cable can be easily adjusted using these clamps. And the multiple pendant lamp is ready. Now let's make a decorative desk lamp. I'm using a conical basket and a copper string light which has tiny LED bulbs like this. First I'm gonna secure the end of the string light on the top of the basket and then I'm gonna push the bulbs out through the gaps and it will stay there. I'm gonna do the same with all the other bulbs and it's ready. Doesn't it look whimsical? First, let's transform this plain basket by giving it a touch of gold. I'm using acrylic metallic gold color here. Without much effort, the basket is completely transformed and looks so festive.
to give bohemian touch to the basket just paint it partially in any light shade for this one i used leftover wall paint in white and gray though acrylic paint can be used too once the paint was dried i added pom pom lace with the help of hot glue and the bohemian beauty is ready to adorn your home I'm using this basket again. I just made a macrame loop at the base and hanged it on the wall. And then I placed a dangling plant inside it and look how pretty it looks. Now to transform this kind of basket what you can do is you can add one hook at the back like so and then here you can add mirror or something like what I'm going to do right now what I'm doing is I'll just take a small piece of this double sided tape and then I'm going to stick it here in the center I'll remove this backing and here we can use multiple things like i have these coasters you can find its tutorial on my channel so i'm gonna use this and i'll stick it here like so it's ready and now i can use it as a wall hanging we can also remove it easily and use something else like i can use this coaster or maybe this one and I have so many options like this newspaper coaster I can use this too just stick it here press it a little and it's ready it's quite economical and you can change the look in jiffy and it comes out easily too so i'm gonna stick this coaster here and let me show you how it looks on the wall Next is this macrame basket planter to adorn the walls of your home. I already have its tutorial up on my channel. You can check out the description box. The last but not least. Baskets can be used as a storage bin too and they look quite trendy. Place them anywhere in your home to get organized or just to hide the clutter. So I really hope you enjoyed this video and uh, if you make something like this, don't forget to share the pictures with me. This is my Instagram ID and this is my Facebook ID. That's all for today and I'll see you soon in my next video. Till then watch either this video or this. Bye-bye. Wish you all love, luck and sunshine.